Hello and welcome everyone to IT Pro Guide YouTube channel. In this video, we're gonna see how to configure Send Connector. In the last video, you saw how to install Exchange Server 2019, but that is not enough to send an email from your Exchange Server. To send an email to external organizations or external emails like Google or Gmail, Yahoo, then you need a Send Connector. So in this video, we're gonna see how to configure a Send Connector. Before you configure Exchange Server Send Connector, you need to know how you're gonna send an email from your Exchange organization to outside. For example, you can send an email directly from your Exchange Server to external organizations. It means you open port 25 SMTP and NAT with your Exchange Server. So your Exchange Server gonna directly communicate uh, with external email servers over the internet. This is not a general or highly recommended topology. So instead of uh, sending emails directly from your exchange server, you can use a third party dedicated appliance or devices as a secure email gateway in your organization. So the exchange server will send email to the secure email gateway. The secure email gateway will communicate with the external email servers and this is how the email transfer is going to work. So in this case, the exchange server is safe. It is not communicating directly with the external email servers. And also it is not exposed to the DMZ or Edge network. Cisco Iron Port, then Barracuda, uh, Symantec Secure Email Gateway, Mail Shell are some of the examples for dedicated secure email gateway. More than handling the emails, this will also add some protections like advanced threat protection, DDoS attack protection, then antivirus, anti-spam. Smart Host is a another option where you can have a cloud secure email gateway and by using this you can send and receive emails from your exchange server organization which also add the same level of protection what a dedicated uh, secure gateway provides for the organizations so we're going to do all these three configurations in the send connector in this video let us start the configuration of send connector i talked to you about three methods in the first option we're gonna configure send connector to send email directly from exchange server for that open exchange uh, administration control panel then go to send connector from here you can create a new send connector choose internet to send an external email then give a meaningful name then click next here you have two options mx record associated with the recipient domain or root mail through a smart host Keep MS record associated with the recipient domain, then click next. Here I put star so I can send email to any domain. Then add source server. Here the source server is our mailbox server. I have only one mailbox server. If you have I have availability or DAG, then it will show multiple mailbox servers. So that is all. This is how to configure a send connector to send email directly. Now let us see how to configure a send connector to send email through a secure email gateway that you installed in your data center. For example, Cisco Iron Port or secure email gateway from Symantec. For that, go to the same send connector and select to, and create a new send connector and give a meaningful name. Then select a custom, then click next. Select the second option, root mail through a smart host then enter the IP address of your on-premises secure email gateway. Here, my secure email gateway is 192.168.1.21. Then if it requires an authentication, you can select an authentication. Most of the cases, the edge transport device or the Cisco Iron Port or secure email gateway uh, relay this exchange server. So you don't need uh, to have any uh, username and password. So based upon your environment, you can do that. Then, as I did before, you can put star here so that uh, your exchange server can send email to any domain. Then click next. Then add your source server. Here, the source server is my exchange server. Then click finish. That is all. So now we configured a send connector to send email through on premises secure email gateway. Next, we're going to see how to configure a send connector to send an email through a smart host. For that, go to 
exchange admin center then from send connector create a new send connector then select internet then give a meaningful name for the send connector then click next select root mail through smart host then add the smart host here you're gonna give the IP address or the domain name of your smart host so for example I'm using Barracoda as my smart host so I can copy the address from Barracoda let's see how to do that this is my Barracoda smart host work from the cloud network so I'm gonna copy the host name from Barracoda so that my exchange server can uh, send email uh, directly to Barracoda and Barracoda will send email to external email addresses so copy the host name the interface may differ uh, depends upon the smart host gateway that you use here Barracoda you will get it from the domains when you expand the domain you will get it once you copy it enter the smart host address here then click save then click next here you can see some authentication method if it is a smart host work uh, from outside your network most of the smart hosts use a username password based authentication so here I'm gonna give the credentials for that then click next then here you're gonna add the address space as we did before you can just put a star so that uh, it can send email to any domain then click next then click next then add source servers select exchange server then click OK click finish so we completed all the three options so following are the three options that we can configure a send connector in exchange to send external emails Thanks for watching this video. For more videos, subscribe my YouTube channel.